come to the Wellington Arms out of hours to talk to the cellar manager, Jamie, to talk about real ale and its popularity in today's world. Let's take a look. Uh, do you want to be asked a few questions? Yeah, no problem at all. No, no, please. What is real ale? Well, real ale is um, it's, it's beer basically. It is beer that undergoes secondary fermentation outside the brewery in a cellar, uh, which takes five to seven working days, and then it's ready, ready to serve. There are around 4,000 different beer brands in the UK, but just how many are served here at the Wellington Arms? Well, I, over, over the years, quite, quite a few. I can't, I can't give you an exact number, but um, the, the, the guest beers here are ever-changing. Um, we're always getting beers from new breweries that are opening up, and um, the amount of breweries that are opening up is it's hard, to, hard to keep on top of it, you know, but... Um, yeah, we're getting, getting new and, and different guest beers every week, which, which I've never seen before. So, in recent years, has real ale grown to be more popular to the youth? Very much so, uh, I would say. I think generally people associate it with a uh, sort of older man sort of thing, but. Uh, Nowadays we're getting a lot of younger people coming in and trying the beers and uh, yeah there's, there's definitely a, a lot of youth, you know, a lot of my friends now are, are drinking real ale and really sort of, you know, broaden their horizons with, with, with the different beers that they drink and um, it's, it's good to see the whole, the whole thing's just taken off, it's, uh, it's a massive industry now. So what does your job as cellar manager involve? Well there's well, the best way to do it is, is to get down there and show you. So uh, yeah, that's right. We'll, we'll, we'll go and have a look. <laughs> have a look. Right, bearing in mind, guys, it's a very old pub. It's over 120 years old. It's only about four foot high. You've got slouch down. We'll get in there, and I'll uh, I'll explain a few things to you. What exactly happens down here then? Well, I have to make sure there's always stock. I have to keep stock updated. Make sure there's always beer. That nothing runs out, and maintain the cellar. I clean the floors twice a week. Hygiene is quite important. Um, with the beers, I take all the empties out, I'll put new beers into the cellar, I will then leave those for two days to get up to the cellar temperature which is about 11 to 13 degrees. I will then tap them and leave them open, which is called venting, and then shutting it off again. That's that's secondary fermentation, that's, that's the process. And that's why it differs from other beers, real ale, undergo secondary fermentation outside the brewery and in the cellar. It's very important to keep everything very clean and wash your lines on a regular basis, keg, keg lines included. Um, these aren't done quite as often as all the real ales, probably once a fortnight, and, uh, and the ciders also. But uh, all the real ales, the lines must be kept very clean.